Hi everyone, it's Lucy here. Today I wanted to bring you a video on the second video in the series Confessions and today is Confessions of a Movie Theater Employee Box Office Edition. Number one, similar as the last video, no, we don't make the pricing that is the ticket pricing. It is more expensive to buy a ticket after during the week it's 6 p.m. and weekends it is 4 matinee will end at that time so anything after that the prices will go up to our adult pricing number two on Tuesdays it hasn't been five dollars per ticket in over three and a half years at this point number three yes you do need to buy your four-year-old child a ticket no they do not count as half of a person Number four, when you walk up to a box office attendant and say you just want two tickets and we say for which movie and you respond with, oh, you can't read my mind. Ha, ha, ha. No, I can't. And if I hear that joke one more time, I'm going to scream. <laughs> Number five, we are supposed to charge any person over the age of 12 years old with an adult price ticket unless you have a valid student or military ID or you are a senior citizen. Number six, we never assume a patron is a senior unless they ask for a senior discount. We'd never want to insult anybody. Number seven, we have a policy no under six after six. That means no child under six years old after 6 p.m. into an R-rated movie. It's only fair to the adults that are paying to see it as well. We don't need an upset child in a theater. Number eight, if we ask you to donate to the charity we are supporting, please just say no thank you or not today. We don't need to hear what other charities you donate to or how our charity doesn't actually go all the profits to there. Please, we're just trying to be respectful, doing our job, asking for the donation. Please just say no or no thank you. Number nine, I'm sorry your theater's cold. We realistically can only change the thermometer about two degrees. We only have access to change about 68 to 70 degrees in each theater. I'm sorry if it's too cold or too hot. Number 10, I'm sorry if you didn't enjoy your movie, but if you watch the entire film, we cannot offer you a refund if you didn't enjoy it. You did choose to see it. Next time, you can come out before halfway through the movie and you can get a refund or exchange it for a different movie. Just not if you watch the entire thing. Number 11, if you are under 17 or do not have a photo ID, I'm sorry, I can't sell you a ticket to an R-rated film. It's our policy. Number 12, I'm sorry, but we can't directly accept Fandango gift cards because they are a third-party company. You do have to buy your tickets ahead of time online. We just need the 15-digit confirmation code, and that's what we can write in through our computers. I'm sorry for the inconvenience, but it is on the back of all their gift cards. We are not Fandango. We are whatever your theater is. Number 13, when you're coming with a group of a bunch of people and you're going to see an R-rated film, please make sure that somebody is over 21 and has a photo ID or everybody brings their IDs. We will ID if you look usually about under 30 or 25. Be prepared so you won't get upset if we ID and somebody doesn't have their ID or the one person that does isn't 21. Number 14, I'm sorry, but we do not hold tickets at box office. It's a safety thing for you and for us as a company. I'm sorry, but we don't know what your relative or your friend looks like. We don't want to give it to the wrong person and have you get upset that we did something wrong. So we err on the side of caution and we don't hold tickets. And number 15, if you're coming to an opening weekend of a film, please plan ahead and get there about 30 to 45 minutes before your movie, unless it's not a big blockbuster there is a high chance it could sell out or you could not get the desired seats that you would like during your film. So thank you guys for watching the second video in this series. I will continue to do one. I want to do one about confession and a Schengen ticket poll as well and maybe some other ones in there that aren't movie theater related but other job related. Thank you guys for watching. If you have any other video ideas please leave them down in the comments section down below like and subscribe and have a wonderful day bye everyone